here we are at uh, Dr. W.E.B. Du Bois Center for Pan-Africanism. Dr. W.E.B. Du Bois was a very good friend of uh, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah. He was his mentor, actually. He really encouraged him to come to Ghana when he received a letter from the first political party known as UGCC to become the general secretary. So he accepted that he came and then he helped uh, to uh, uh, revolutionize and change things in uh, the Gold Coast before we had independence in uh, 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 1957. Now, uh, when Dr. W. E. Du Bois was invited to Ghana, when we had in independence during our celebration, uh, he, couldn't, he wasn't given a passport, according to history, later before he had it. So when he had it, he came, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah gave him this place to stay. Uh, the reason why he was also given those places, um, he was then writing Encyclopedia Africa. He couldn't finish till he passed on. Yeah, but right now, there are other authors who came in and they have finished and we have it here. But it's unfortunate we won't be able to go in there to see. Now, be just behind you, the better that you see the, uh, there was a tree there that Dr. B. E. B. Du Bois sat under to receive visitors, you know, the fresh air. You will not allow to go inside the uh, use air condition whatsoever. You will like the fresh air. So he sat there to receive visitors. Uh, when he died, uh, later the tree also fell. So the tourism authority decided that, why can't we build something like this that looks like a tree? Uh, and then he will still receive visitors. Although he's not there, he will still receive visitors. He was buried at a castle and later exhumed and gave him a final befitting burial in here. <clears throat> it's unfortunate it's closed, we won't be able to go in, else we'll see his tomb. So this is the Dr. W. E. Du Bois Memorial Center. Uh, we'll go, we'll walk to my left, and then we'll see uh, Marcus Garvey's house, and then we'll see African Americans uh, Society in Ghana, the building that they have also put up there. In the African diaspora forum. Uh, in the African, and people from the diaspora, when they come, they can also, you know, visit there to see. So we need to see, definitely. Then from there, we'll come and take some pictures, and then off we go. We can just do this in about 10 minutes. Thank you so much. Madasi. Uh, perfect. Anybody have any questions about the boys or the center, anything for Kwabina? Okay. Whilst, so, we are, um, um, whilst going... When he came here, he was a triple holder, I understand. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Uh, can you repeat your question? He was 19 when oh, he came here. Yeah, he was, he was over, over, over 80 years, years okay. when he came here. And yes. when he died, he was... Uh, 96. 96. Yes. And that's too, too long after he came here. He was uh, after? When, no, I think when he came here, about six years later, yeah, he died. The wife also was cremated. The wife was cremated. She yeah, Shelly, Shelly Graham. Yeah. So he was told, um, I thought he was buried, he cremated, um, he was cremated. No, he was not. Dr. Dobi Dibu was not. Oh, but the wife? By the wife, okay. was cremated. Wow. All right, Roots woman, get on in, jump on in, jump on in, in, in. You love that being in Mantunio. <laughs> That's a ringtone. I got a beady man ringtone I'm about to put on mine. Okay, this time I'm <laughs> sure that I get it right. Okay. Anything you don't see is because of the tree. Okay. <laughs> oh, the plant yeah, yeah. Check it this out. Don't mm. I like it. All right. Good. Yeah, what I'm, film, what I'm filming is Brandon. Oh, okay. Right. okay. Matter of fact, you just send that to me. I just go off you. Bet. And so family, this is the Du Bois house. Uh, either the hours have changed or certain things have changed, but the Rona has gotten all kind of things jacked up over the, the world. And if we don't fight to keep moving forward, these people, you know, will bring us, bring us back to the dark ages. The Great Reset. The great Reset.
and also family listen make sure we give you that nice shot of the Du Bois bus the sign itself So family, that is literally the memorial that housed the boys' remains. She, um, she used to mentor, what's the name of the girl that come in, um, Teray came over here, the stage with oh, her. Yeah, so he come, she mentored her. Yeah. Let's get you back here, show you the rest of the compound. There is a restaurant here. And uh, as you can see, the, the Rona got all kind of things jacked up. I've never seen this place closed since I've been here from 2006 to now. So we're just being real with your family and letting you know that all kind of foolishness going on, you know, when, we, when we're given to these kind of things, next thing you know, our historical, cultural places and things like that, you know, adjustments have to be made and, and things like that. So this is a serious diplomatic mission to show the energy of us I still care. So get you over to you know the sign. I love the big beautiful black bow letters. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, absolutely, yes. Yeah. You want to have something nice to say? Uh, I, uh, I'll cut it and get your feedback real quick. <laughs> Didn't you say when Bill Clinton came, there was like a bunch of African dignitaries from all over Africa that came? Yeah. I'm saying when Obama came, was it? Oh, the same no, 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 no. It wasn't, it, wasn't, it wasn't like that. Bill Clinton's own was, it, it supersedes. In doing a little Jamaica. Of people that Jamaica, Jamaica. Obama was just in And then Obama's room. Yes, family. Let's see this important sign right here. Oh, no. I've actually never even walked back here. But inside this building is actually nice, a nice presentation. I've seen it open only 25% of the time since I've been here. So this is what my sister's talking about as we're here in the W.E.B. Du Bois compound with the Marcus Garvey Center, but you know, this is the African Diaspora Forum area. This is us reconnecting in. Yeah, about 10 years. So that's when I've been, I've seen this thing open up for about 10 years. Wow. But family, even though these buildings are not open, you know, us, we're going to still push the energy. And our brother, yeah, come hook us up with a nice group picture. All right, family, uh, can we get a few group pictures? One in front of the forum, one in front of Garvey Center. If we can have a good picture here, I think it will also be good. Yeah, that's place. Yeah, and then you place here. Right, you guys, join us for a group picture. Yes, Kobe, did you know all these things are shut down? Did you, the Rona got everybody. Rona, Rona, Rona. 
Boxing Day, what is that? It's a holiday. So it's a holiday. Hey, Kwabna, is, is, uh, is, is Boxing Day was over the weekend, though. Yeah, so it fell on. You're gonna the celebrate these stupid British holiday, the Boxing Day. I remember hearing about that in Jamaica. Yes, yes. Ghanaians do celebrate. But it's not like the former. Formerly, Boxing Day, people give dates and other things. Now, Boxing oh, Day is. I want to see a Boxing Day when a Ghanaian knock out some of them British in the, in, in the boxing ring. That's what I want to see. Oh, Boxing Day, they need to bring their gloves. <laughs> come and box. Yeah. Oh, please. Can you, can you please go? Come on, make it nice and tight. The family, our energy of solidarity. So, Kobla, cool here we go, my brother. Snap, snap for us. Okay.